Okay. We're nearly there. Research lab is through that archway. Let's move. Oh, I like this mission. What, what? Like tequila to catch you. <laughs> A general orgy time, is it? So, uh, apologies for the last set of videos, guys. Um, no wonder they I actually uh, accidentally recorded it in 480 rather than full 1080, which kind of pissed me off, so it was slightly lower quality. But uh, it's been repaired this time, so that won't be happening again. Oh, cool shades, man. Those look like 3D glasses. <laughs> it's the fucking 80s, bitch. <laughs> Oh, I just saw, it was, I think it was an American Dad where he was wearing, like, a 3D glasses to try and uh, blend in with the class. <laughs> like, with teenagers. American Dad? I think so. May have been another cartoon show, I don't know, I watch a lot of them. Ah, uh, a Bob's Burgers. Oh, no, you know what? It was actually, uh, China, Illinois. Yeah. I've never heard of that one. It's pretty. It's an adult sum. It's pretty amusing. We'll go head up these stairs because you know she's going this way. AI pathing's pretty good in this game, isn't it? Like it's really funny how bad it is in Colonial Marines compared to this. Oh God, yeah. <laughs> it's like, oh wow, she's actually uh, moving and reacting to stuff. I must admit, I'm surprised to see you here. <laughs> Oh, Does she actually must be losing broadside of the bar? Or perhaps <laughs> luck has been on your side. My name is Carl Bishop Whalen. And <laughs> oh shit, Marcus I forgot to tell you, Will. All you have to I'll do tell you after Hanlan Hanlan's time was in soon as talking. At least, not by any of my personnel. Shit, right. So I was playing uh, Colonial Marines again. All of it. And it updated. Yeah. And you're gonna love what the update did. Oh no. <laughs> no argument. You know Ron Pearl no Necklace course. Man? The guy with the fucking <laughs> fucking smart gun that doesn't hit shit? Yeah. <laughs> they replaced the smart gun with a pulse rifle. Whatever you say, oh god, that's hilarious. <laughs> it's fucking great. Oh, log time. Through you, we're beginning to understand the complexity of your hive structure. Your hierarchy is as adaptive as your biology. A true meritocracy. Where the lowest vassal can rise to rule. They always sound so perverted to me. Oh, shit, the bug really messed me with my guts. Yeah, like just like creepy to in some degree. Mm -hmm. What's his name is the worst though. Oh, Groves, he's the best man. <laughs> Impregnation and gestation. Here we go again. That's the first time we've seen one of those. Why would it be like coded to her? Doesn't make any sense. She just used a biometric scanner that was encoded to her. Maybe she's working with the enemy. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. Oh, coffee cup. Down there, a Xeno. Guess the way droids didn't get them all yet. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. I forgot I disturbed him eating lunch. I should have just let him chew on him, shouldn't I? What, was it a robot or something he was eating? Or was uh, that like, actually like a fresh person? I think it was a person. Security is our key stop. All personal transmissions will be delayed for They just call this monorail. All portable data storage Did devices they? are strictly I thought it was a fucking elevator. Yeah, monorail terminus. Ah. Oh, it is an actual monorail terminal, though. Oh, here's the monorail. Okay, okay. Yeah, because we're in the elevator that goes to the monorail, I guess. Oh no, more milk machines. Excuse me while I fire my sniper rifle all over the fucking place. Oh, I got his head. I actually do like the uh, like the addition of these enemies because it's like you can't they don't really have vital points so there's no real much point aiming just for the head. It's still obnoxious because you're fighting like you know you're playing an aliens game and you're fighting you know human enemies. I I, I kind of get the complaints, uh, but I mean like at least it's different than just fucking 
you know, Clone Marines, which was just fucking mercenaries near enough the entire way fucking through. Well, like, you know, for a game that's called AVP, you fight for surprisingly few predators. You only fight one, actually, as a Marine. Yeah. But the idea is, is that the predators are meant to be the uh, toughest enemy in the game, and playing the multiplayer, you could believe that because of the way they set the multiplayer up. In a multiplayer match, just so you know, there can be, I think it's uh, six, I think six players either side. So you could be like have six marines versus six aliens, but there's only ever allowed to be two predators, max. Because well, they could have known just scaled back the predators and just had, you know, a different cast of predators beyond the planet. Hmm. So have, like, the royal predators, you know, so they're the ones with all the cool kit, and then also have just, you know, normal ones that maybe have hard, more hit points, but don't have, like, crazy fucking weapons. Yeah, the predator is... overpowered. In this game. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Oh god, I feel fucking embarrassed. Fight everywhere there. Oh, I hit that time. I like the dudes with no heads. Oh shit, was that an alien? It was, wasn't it? Yeah. No, it's a jungle xeno bastard. You gotta call oh, it. Okay, name. okay, okay. Your, your favourite slur, is it now? As I saw in the YouTube comments. Oh yeah, I was thinking uh, if you ever if you do any more Colonial Marines videos, like what you can do is uh, as a gag, like mention how they sound like cats and like get a recording of one of the cats like while you hold it because they generally get rather grumpy if you do that. <laughs> yeah, um, I could probably get Edward to do it because hey, your cats don't really get as grumpy as ours though. No, they don't. No, our, our cats are reasonably good tempered. I was, yeah, I was thinking if you got, like, triples, because she gets the most, like, vocal if you pick her up. Mm -hmm. His cuddles, like, squeaks, she doesn't make normal cat noises. His cuddles just straight up growls, and, or triples just, like, makes little growls and stuff. You know, looking at all this Wayland yutani shit, it kind of just reminds me of the company I work for, you know? Oh, sorry. It's okay, I'll cut it out. <laughs> I completely <laughs> forgot you didn't want to mention that. Yeah, it, I mean, I, I can sort of mention it, you know, but I can't mention mention it. Right? I mean, it makes no sense. Uh, I, I definitely think they're more like along the lines of Walmart. Who are? Uh, oh, Wayland yeah. Yeah, wait and you wait and he's Walmart. That's the fucking best statement I've ever heard. These dangerous creatures. Like it even has like the Let's same logo, you know, just like the giant W. Struggle. Listen to reason. Retreat from this facility and await rescue. This is your last chance. <laughs> so wait, so is Wayland alive? Like giving you like threatening messages? Huh? I guess he is. He's like the uh, the Walmart welcomer. Okay, that's really bugging me how she can use all these biometric scanners. Apparently it's something to do with marine clearance, they have clearance for everything. Which doesn't really make fucking sense anyway. Well then why wouldn't you fucking do it? Well, cause she's more rank- she's higher ranking than you. Oh, I that's love- right, your rank is Rookie. Yeah. <laughs> that's your name as well, Rookie. Wouldn't it be funny if his also, name- like, wouldn't Will and Yutani just be able to lock down the doors if he's like in some sort of control area? You'd think so, wouldn't you? Oh, um, I think the air is on minimal power, though. I was about to say, like, they should make you have to slice through the doors and stuff, but then that gave me, uh, bad flashbacks. Oh, good. Ugh. I to another Hurry. alien game where you have to slice through doors. Get her mm. onto the table. Oh, look, they have, like, the Prometheus table. It's gonna do the auto, uh, we alien abortion. Oh. Auto alien abortion. Wait, are you really holding your hand? Yeah, man, she likes black dick. We are ready. Just pray nobody notices the drain. Um. I should have known. 
These operations are vital to Whale and Yutani's interests. Any attempt to compromise them is an act of sabotage. As for company directives. Come on. Come on. You're not allowed free food at Walmart. <laughs> Even if you work there. Call and brought the Marines here. That was yeah, so it was, it was her who sent the distress call. <laughs> okay, so we can shut down the little operating table but not the fucking doors. Okay, Get to the I'd eat fucking stupid, I don't know. But when you think about it, it doesn't make sense because if Katia is an android and supposedly the company built androids, why would they be able to rebel? And also, hold on, right here. You know, putting someone in crowd sleep doesn't suspend uh, alien, you know, gestation. Like they did that in, uh, I think it was at the end of two, going into three. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Well, hang on, no, the the face hugger like attached itself to her face while she was in hyper damaging the hyper sleep container. So one would assume it broke it. Oh. Good so. To finally meet you. Please. You could argue that alive. though, certainly. And well, wasn't the dog in hyper sleep or? No, that's right. The dog was on the planet. I yeah. To be called what I am, an android. Or if you're watching the director's cut, it was actually a bull. But I'm on your side, not theirs. With your colonial marine cruiser and its dropships destroyed, there's only one. God, I'm getting an erection just hearing her speak. <laughs> oh, look, iPads. There, that device in Wayland's hand. It's an executive data pad. It's a fucking it's an iPad. A transmitter. It's just in a rescue dropship. Will home right to it. I prefer I the term tablet computer. Trump. It's less offensive. You go to the pyramid <laughs> and get that data pad. I'll rendezvous with you there. Oh, and private. Say goodbye to Mr. Wayland for me, will you? Yes, that's a hell of an accent, isn't it? I know my wife's gonna have an accent like that. I won't say could... anything less. <laughs> Are you a member of RussianBrides.com or something, or, and you just haven't told me yet? Nah, but I will be when I get the money. I mean, you can get a bride for like 15 grand. Ah, uh, fuck it. I like how the uh, the aliens are indiscriminate in this game or attack everything. Yeah, those are like total madness. They're just like running around, just like fighting you, fighting the android. Yeah. Oh, I'm being raped! <laughs> Fucking. I like how the tactic just becomes just block and knock them back. What the fuck was that one doing? He like flew through there. Yeah. Oh, he, he, he got a taste for androids, I guess. In this part, you just see me hang back. Yeah, yeah fuck it, I'll let him chew on the androids. But what hey. I don't understand is that, like, when you block with your gun, like, it stops 100% of the damage. Yeah, I think... It would actually be more interesting if you just still took damage, wouldn't it? Like, but only a, li a little bit kind of thing. Yeah, or like you just weren't staggered by the attack. Mm-hmm. Well, when you play on the hardest difficulty, you know, you know the way you block and you knock them to the floor? Right, on the hardest difficulty, that never happens. They will just, like, stun them for, like, a fraction of a second. Oh, crazy. It won't actually knock them to the floor like it does on normal mode. Yeah. And believe it or not, that makes the game ten times harder. Well, yeah, because you don't get, like, a free, like, kill. Yeah, pretty much. Ah, uh, trying to get my sniper ass on. Ah, uh, you little bitch! Fucking hiding up on the balcony. If I just shoot his arm off, fuck it. Oh, there he goes. I like the the over intense music as well. I think it's funny is like you know you're in the last chapter of the game, and uh, you're still rookie. Like they never reveal your name or anything. 
<laughs> yeah, it's just like you're forever to be known as rookie, even though everyone else is dead. That bitch just got a flamethrower. Come to daddy. I don't actually pick it up again. What sniper rifle flamethrower combo would be choice? Yeah. That's the only thing I don't like about the flamethrowers, it just eats through ammo. Oh yeah, you, like you like you only get like three kills with a clip. Pretty much. So it's not really beneficial to pick it up because you don't actually really get it that much in this last section at all. Again, yeah, you're right, that's so fucking obnoxious the way you shoot the heads off and they're still peeking around the corner. <laughs> it doesn't make any it's sense. Like, yeah, it's like he doesn't have any fucking Oh. Oh man, I popped his Swede. <laughs> it exploded on the wall. Let me in! It says it's green. Fucking doors. No, it's only green for aliens. Sorry, right, jungle xeno bastards. Okay, jungle xeno bastards, yes. Yeah, playing this game back, something I've noticed since I've been playing a lot of PC, I've gotten used to like higher frame rates, is there are a lot of frame rate dips in this game. Oh, there's that head, uh, the guy you shot off. <laughs> yeah, just like on the floor. Oh, isn't this where the uh, alien campaign starts? Yeah. Like this exact room? Yeah, pretty much, I think. Yeah, yeah, I think it is that room. Oh! Nature creates beauty in many forms. And you, Six. You are the most beautiful of all. I shall break you, Six. Bend you to our purpose. Humanity is the new power in the universe. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'll bend you. I'll break, break you. you. <laughs> You're the most beautiful of all. <laughs> I fucking love Groves. He's like the best voice actor in this fucking game. <laughs> I mean, Lance Hyrickson's pretty good. Despite watching you grow these weeks, observing intimately for hour after hour, you still fill me with awe. <laughs> you are a biotechnical treasure waiting to be exploited. <laughs> each gene sequence, each enzyme, each protein is a key to great wealth and power. You are special, Six. So very special. What the fuck? Is that oh, Jesus! <laughs> Central. <laughs> oh, I really love these audio logs. coming from the ceiling. Uh, but both those, just those two audio logs in like succession like that. Lockdown procedures implemented. Oh, iPads. I have to possess the secrets of the burial chamber. If it holds what I suspect it must, it will secure Wayland Yutani as the dominant force for progress and profit. The risk computer is the key to many things. I think I heard a speech like that once. <laughs> Makes the dominant force. Yeah. I'm getting feedback, dude. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Fucking, there, you'll just watch him get raped. Why not? Just what? I'm going to watch them get raped. Ugh. Don't worry, there's plenty of rape to go around, Liam. Is that what they say in, like, Vietnam? Did you just say shield critical? 
Oh, I see how that guy's got like a fluorescent thing on him. Yeah. Like he looks weird. It's because he had an invisible shield. Uh huh. Guess what they've been studying. Hmm. So, what do you think about that, uh, Will? Invisible androids. That's interesting. Yeah. That's a nice touch. Yeah. What they need are, uh, like, their own android versions of aliens now. Android aliens? We know there are propaganda chemicals transmitted between your brothers and sisters. We know you have rudimentary broad spectrum sight that you can hear. But there is more to your kind, isn't there? A hive mind beyond any clumsy biochemical exchange. What is buried in your mind, I wonder? What precious commodities? Not as pervy as the last one. Nah. Still, I will bend uh, you. I'll break you. Yeah, by the way, I got stuck here. Oh, oh, hmm. Like, I was just like, I was trying to walk away and it just kept walking. There we go, I got, I got broke free. About face through. Ah, fuck, that. <laughs> fuck that wall. So, this game does have bugs, not as bad as uh, Clone Marines, though. Oh god, no. Oh god. Is it going to be a stand-up fight, sir, or a bug hunt? That's pretty much what Colonial Marines was for everybody. It was a bug hunt, wasn't it? That's what it turned into. Yeah. Who, fi who finds the better bugs? This game's actually got good music, surprisingly. I'm only just noticing that. What's that? Yeah, slippery surface. Be warning, a warning of alien shit on the floors. Well, what's nice is there's not like fucking a pulse rifle fire going 100% of the time, so you can actually hear the music. <laughs> I think it's funny that you just mentioned one of the number one fucking complaints. That even though the pulse rifle was probably the best sound effect in the game, it's pretty much the only sound effect you hear. For the it's entire the, yeah, it's game. the only sound. Like the soundtrack for that game is just pulse rifle going for like, you know, the 45 minutes. <laughs> It's sort of one moment at the end of the fucking LP where fucking Ron Perlman was just fucking shooting the side of the wall for like five minutes. Yeah. And there was an enemy behind the wall just ducked down. Ugh, superior AI, eh? Ugh. Clever girls, they're learning. I gotta admit, I, I do actually like the change up of the Android mm. battles because it does, ch yeah, the, the gameplay changes. Yeah. Because with aliens, you just kind of get used to just block and hit, block and hit kind of thing. And these guys, you actually have to use like FPS strats kind of thing and like duck behind cover and things. And to be fair, they do hit pretty fucking hard as well. Yeah. That you can't, they're no joke. It'd be cool if they had predators, though. Mm hmm. So you have to cover and then, you know, do the duck and block as soon as they get in melee. Yeah. So if you're not in cover, then they'll, you know, throw a spear or something at you. Yeah! 